Okay guys, welcome to the channel. I'm Joshua Spice as well. You guys here today. So today we'll be looking at this uh powerful macro strategy right here, which you can uh usually make use of and take at least 10 candles out of the market. This is a powerful strategy which you can be using, and you can see right here with this strategy alone, you can be getting this boom crash, make tons of money trading with this uh boom crash strategy alone okay and i guarantee that with this strategy right here you can be able to make at least oil out of uh, 500 dollars in a single day using this strategy right here okay so uh before we dive into the strategy don't forget to make sure you uh subscribe to the channel subscribe to the channel subscribe to the channel like this video and turn on post notification and type your strategy you guys will be aware so uh with that being said right here you can see let me quickly show you guys how this strat how effective this strategy is and i'm going to, I'm going to show you guys settings for the strategy which you can see is your this uh this is a trade this is a trade right here with this uh complaints of the strategy okay so see let's go back and look for another sort of entry which you can see we have another one right at this area so you can see we have another one right here and you can see how effective this uh tree move so this strategy is very very effective strategy very very effective is very very effective strategy which can be using so you can see you have another trade right at this area uh we have another one right here so you can see we have another one right here and it move uh greatly it's move greatly you can cut at least 10 to 15 or 20 candles with this strategy alone you can cut as much as can do as you want so with this guarantee we are going to take at least uh 10 to 15 candles even 20 candles with this strategy alone so with that being said let me show you guys how this strategy is done i'm sure you guys how the strategy is done so now right here to make use of this strategy let me show you guys the settings uh so you guys will be know the uh the indicator that you are going to be using before you guys how you are going to make use of the strategy okay so now let's go to the indicator window so you can see these all the settings that we are going to need for the strategy okay now the first which we are going to, which we are going to be using is the moving average which is going to be in our main chart now click on the moving average and there's the properties now to add this indicator up just have to click on your mini do plus okay if you are using an android you are going to see f plus so just click on it and search for your moving average now this is the properties for the moving average the build is going to be 10 the shift is going to be two. the method is linear with 10 apply to uh close the levels no we don't need any levels uh apply to all time flips so you can choose any color of your choice so we set everything up like this then click on done and you're going to see your moving average right in your chart okay now moving on to the uh next indicator so once you add this moving average up it's going to be in your main chart and then to add this commodity channel index up so just click on the main window plus and then search for your commodity channel index and click on it now we'll click on the commodity channel index is the properties the period is one thing apply to typical price hlc slash three and the levels we just need the minus zero and the zero levels click on done and then the time frame is all time frame just any color of your choice and click on done so once you set that up then you are moving up you are moving on to the next which is uh the last but not the least indicator so once you have this commodity channel is up it's going to be listed in your indicator window one now the next moving average the next one the next indicator we are going to be adding is going to be the rsi so click on the indicator window one plus and search for rsi now this is the properties for the rsi the period is going to be 10 the apply to median price hrc2 levels we are going to be needing the 90 10 50 80 levels so just any color of your choice and click on done okay so when it sets everything up like this then this our chart is going to look like this our chart is going to look like okay now for the uh zoom levels of the strategy for the zoom level so once you zoom out completely just use the third zoom level which is one two okay your zoom are completely you are going to be using them at two sorry uh it's going to be like one two okay so that is the time frame that's the zoom level you are going to be using and uh, we are going to visit the one minute time frame okay we're going to use the one minute time frame now 
let's get things straight right here so to use the strategy right here the first thing you have to mark out which you have to take note of is that remember we are on we are on crash so no matter anything we want to do in the market we are expecting to go for a buy okay no matter the circumstances of the market we are going to go in for a buy now the first confirmation that we need to see is that we need to see this uh cci at the overbought levels you have to be at the overbought levels when it's at the overbought level the next thing we want to look out for is we want to make sure that we see a changing of direction which means that once you see the price selling selling which means that the market the market is spiking you have to see this direction now changing of direction means that the market needs to move above the moving average when the price move above the moving average then the next one wait for just count at least three second those closing above the price right here it's just to can lose and then but they are not yet to the overbought level which is at this area right here so but it has reached the overbought levels and it's are crossing above it with at least two three can lose and then the next one i'll do is just to jump into the trade you hold your position till you uh till you see changing of direction or till you see the price see this uh touching see this CCI touching the oversold level that is when you are going to raise it imagine if you catch this type uh trend right here you can see you'll be running into a massive massive profit okay so now if you guys another uh sample right here show you guys another sample so if you can see we have another sample i want to look for a clean sample right here so now we have another sample right at, at this area so now this is another sample right here at this area so you can see literally we have this at the overbought level and then we have another one at this uh which you can see we have this changing of direction right here the price is changing direction from a buy from a sell to buy and you can see we have the, this candle closing above the moving average with at least three kind of count this way we are going to jump in and we take all this candle right here so whenever you see the uh multiple spike occurring then if you are a patient trader you will have to uh, just patient enough to wait since the uh, ccis are not yet touched the of uh, both the oversold level then we have to wait so then but if you are not a PN trader, just cut 10 candles and then you are out. But if you are a PN trader, all this spike won't uh, freak you out. So you just have to hold your position and then you catch the unnecessary move. Okay. So that is that on that. And that is how you are going to be make use of the strategy. So just make sure you make your strategy same as I, same as the illustration. And just make sure that your pattern strategy, figure out the strategy you're going to make your own trading scheme and start using the strategy to take trades. Okay. So I hope you guys find this video helpful right here. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe, like, and turn on post notification and type your strategy. You guys should be aware. Thank you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.